Is that you, Rook? Thank Christ, help us out here! Got a man down! I need a medic! Sun's jammed! Rook? I need more ammo! You really saved our bacon. They've been throwing themselves at these walls for days. Just won't let up. They already kicked open a hornet's nest. Trucks on the road! Damn it! Medic! Rook, I need you up on that wall!
Thanks. I'm okay now. Better keep moving. Hello there. <laughs> Rogers, there's an Arkweller somewhere inside. Footy was using it last. Get on it. Well, you're with me. Let's start collecting scrap. You have to pull the doors off some of the cells? Do it! Now hop too! We ain't got much time! Any problems? No. A couple of the Peggy scaled the wall, but we got him. Door. That doesn't look too bad. You'll be all right. Just keep pressure on it. You know, I was gonna retire last year. I was worried I'd get bored. Are you gonna introduce us, or we're just gonna stand around here all awkward and shit? Language! Oh, fuck off, Virgil. Not today. I have told you, a vulgar mind is a sign of... You're not wearing your button! No, I'm not wearing it. I'll need a casualty report. We're, we're cougars! We're really not. Look, I'm wearing my button. The sheriff is wearing his button. This person... I'm sorry, who is this? This is one of my deputies. I thought you said your deputies were taken. Oh, well, this one wasn't. Been giving Eden's Gate a hell of a time from what I hear. That's so. Well, I hope you plan on pitching in. No room for freeloaders. <laughs> oh, Tracy's all right when she gets to know you. She's right about the work, though. There's plenty to be done around here. Just ask around. Good to have you back, Brooke. Okay, then. Nice day. Every hunter needs a good hat and patience. Have like six patience for the shot. Deputy, none of my business, but you might want to ask Virgil or the others for an update. They know the places we need to strike. Honest, never thought I'd see you again. After the crash, I... I just remember fog. Then walking in a field. Then I saw her. You've seen her too, haven't you, Rook? Whatever she says, whatever she promises, it's a lie. Stay away from her, you'll end up just like the Marshal. The bliss. It makes you forget. It makes you feel free. You just want to stay there forever. But it isn't real. None of it. If Virgil and Tracy hadn't found me, I'd still be out there. Swimming. In a sea of bliss. A prisoner in my own head. Those two saved my life. These cougars, they're good people. But they're hanging on by a thread. We gotta help them, Rook. No one else will. One last thing. We had a doctor. Well, a veterinarian, but he's doing his best. Guy went missing a couple hours ago. Don't know why, don't know how. But keep an eye out for him, would you? Hey, sir. Hello? Real? Last two days, we've had a few people go missing. Only from what we can tell, they weren't lost in the bliss. There's been rumors of some place run by Faith's favorites. The kind of place nobody comes back from. Torture, drownings, sacrifices. People say anyone who doesn't walk Faith's little pilgrimage winds up there. He's organizing people I think we've got a real problem on our hands, and I need someone to check it out. Someone who can handle themselves if it turns out to be more than just stories. Be careful, Rook. Another attack could come at any moment. Oh, things are messy right now, but you'd be proud of the sheriff, kiddo. He's organizing people. Real nice. Nice job at the jail, buddy. They got 24 hour patrols around the statue. It'll be a monster of a job to hit that thing. A monster job is what we need to rattle Faith. That girl. Hello. 
Hey. Sorry about before. Wasn't cool. Ask anyone here. I do tough really good, but the rest, well, I'm working on it. So, restart. Welcome. You'll like the team we got. Everyone's strong, and we need to be with what's beyond those walls. I hope Earl's right about you. We've all been trying to figure out how to crush Eden's gate. You ask me, it starts with faith. At least that's what she's calling herself these days. You seen that giant statue on the hill? Of course you have. You can't miss it. Good old Joseph Seed, the father. Faith had her groupies build that concrete eyesore for her sick pilgrimage. You seen them? Those sad fuckers marching their way to that statue? It's horrible. We gotta tear down that statue. Let all those Peggies know their father ain't no fucking god. He's just a man. What do you say, Rook? Go drive a big fuck you size hole into that thing. I ride up these hot ones here. You watch. You got a sec for me? We got one big job around here, and that's to stop Faith. She took everything from me. My job, my marriage, even my son. All because of that bliss. You're one of us now. A cougar. We're a team that helps each other, and I need your help right now, deputy. You know about our water treatment plant? The cult took it and started pumping it full of bliss. You believe that? Right into the drinking water. What kind of monster does that? Well, she's not getting away with it any longer. I tell you straight, we're gonna shut it down fast. What do you say? We're out of our league here with weapons. Peggy's have had heavy caliber guns all along. We got... Use one fat hunk of cement. You're gonna need heavy ammo to take it out. Or something with a mounted gun that flies. You're smart. You'll figure it out.
day you'll see.
I know you've heard stories about me. That I'm a liar. A manipulator. <laughs> that I poison people's minds. Well, let me tell you a different story. A true story. There once was a young woman who had been ostracized by her community, bullied by friends, abused by her family. She took to a needle for help. She was all alone. She wanted to die. And then she met the father. <laughs> he gave her hope and confidence. The father showed her how special she was. She was full of love and life. He gave her a new family, one that accepted her just as she was. The young woman no longer wished to die. She had been given. One day, the father brought her here. He asked if she had faith in him. He asked if she would be willing to die for him. The young woman who very much wished to live was scared. The father told her this was her test. She would have faith in her if she had faith in him. So she closed her eyes and left. <laughs> the father kept his word. The path to Eden is clear to those who have faith. Walk the path. You must have faith. Let go. Do you feel different? Do you feel alive? The first step is always the scariest, but we all have faith in you. Follow the pilgrimage. Walk the path. I'll see you soon.
the water, but you can't stop the bliss. Jewelry to go missing now, too. Never mind. I don't care what you are. I need help. Those miserable shits raided my place trying to kill my peaches. Now she's raced off for her revenge. If I know peaches, she's gone off to chow down on those hippies. She's probably lounging at the nearby campsite. It smells like armpits and processed meat down there. So those Eden Project losers can't be far away. Go on and find her now. Be sure to take her treats with you. She's just like that little drubbing whore at the marina. She'll follow you anywhere if you give her a treat. Now go get my kitty back. Please understand that there is no threat to Eden's gate or the family. I understand now. Didn't take you for the kind to go help and free a bunch of convicts.
true for nature. What the hell? You're not too bad for someone I suspect is Italian. I'll be honest. I figured I'd never see you again. Thought you were a little dim in the headlights, but you proved me wrong. Ah, oh, hell. Why don't you just keep the damn cat? I've enjoyed not having to deal with her incessant needs for food and water and attention the last few days. All right, off you go. We're done here. Thank you for saving me. My name is Dr. Charles Lindsay. I'm part of a group pulled up south of here at the old jail. Faith and her angels have been trying to get to us for days. I was out here looking for a way to stop them when the cult took me. I think I found a way to bait the angels. But the ingredients for the bait are in my bag and the cult food in the pot. My bag! Thanks. I thought. Where's my bag? Oh, where is it? What now? Thank God. Okay. I think I found a way to bait the angels, but the ingredients for the bait are in my bag and the cult food in the pond. And I. I can't swim. I know. I know who can't swim, but I need you to go get it for me.
ready for it! Aiden doesn't want you! Might have a fighting chance against Joseph Seed's brain dead goons now. Sorry, my name's Charles. Everyone calls me Doc, but I'm not. I'm not that kind of doctor. I'm a veterinarian, but right now I guess I'm the resident ER doctor. <laughs> Stitching up bullet wounds is a lot different than delivering cabs. That's for goddamn sure. Sorry, doesn't matter. Here's the deal. I stumbled on something that seems to attract the angels, which means we could herd them. I went out to try a field test, but things went sideways. Fucking cult. I'm missing ingredients, and if I stay out here, I'm just gonna wind up dead. I have to get back to the prison. Can you help me? I've got the list of stuff I still need. If you could find them, we may actually have a chance at surviving. Good God. What was that? You've been invited into our home, into our heart. Trust in the path and you'll find the answers you seek. Even those who fight against us seek salvation. We are proof of that. We all need guidance in times like these. So we must be strong. We must be vigilant. Now you'll see. Now you'll truly understand. Because those on the outside will see what we have built here together in our new Eden. The love. And they will come, and they will try to take from us all that we have built. They judge me. They judge us. The things that we have done. People say that I'm crazy. But when you wake up in the morning, you look at the same news that I do. This is the world? This? This is the world we built for our children? Communities being torn apart? Walls being erected? Because leaders are too impotent to act. Bullies are too adult to lead righteously. towards our destruction and no one is willing to do anything about it. I can see that. You can see. But we are not crazy. So what are we supposed to do? We just sit back and await the inevitable? I claim to be a perfect man. But 
I saw what was coming and I chose to act, to lead, because society is broken. And the only way forward is to go back to the way things once were. Innocent and pure, so safe and protected in our garden. I can save. Jesus Christ, you scared the shit out of us. <laughs> hey, Sheriff. A couple didn't make it back. Boy hey, said... You, anybody grab her? Grady, supposedly, but... Well, where the hell's Grady? Ah, oh, Jesus. Now, you just... You just relax. Lie back. I'll see you in the morning. Yes. You come out of the bliss too fast. Shit's liable to scramble your fucking brains. You won't find these night skies in any big city. Only in Hope You're County. An officer of the law. I'm not sure how much longer we can hold out here. Deputy, uh, I need to ask you something. You ever heard of a fella by the name of Feeney? He was a pharmacist in town. A lot of people looked up to him. Thought he was a pillar of the community, but, uh, truth is he was nothing but a dope pusher. Feeney's with the cult now. Helped him create this bliss. Word is, he's up at Jessup Conservatory. It was a beautiful atrium back before, well, before. Now Feeney's using it to grow his poison. Nothing but fields of those awful flowers. So, I was thinking, if you happen to head over there and burn them flowers, well, I bet Feeney'd come running over in a panic. Stock up while we can. Boy, I'm sure wish I'd grab them corn removal. Any trouble finding the stuff? <laughs> Would have taken me months. And Faith's angels might as well be walking corpses. Too far gone to bring back once you get that much bliss in you. But with this stuff, we might be able to just herd them out of the way. Once it's ready, do you do you do you uh, think you can give it a field test? <laughs> I'm positive it'll work, like 95%. Positive, but we still need to make sure. Full time job. Miss? Deputy. Oh, sorry. 
I need all the ingredients before we can mix a new batch. Now I'll keep working on the formula till you've gotten everything. Deputy, we're set for a trial run. One step at a time, right? Deputy, we're set for a trial run. We shouldn't stay here. Probably wasting your time. To Gotta know how to hunt your own food. You look like you can handle a weapon. longer we can hold out here good thing i called that could have been messy huh sorry about that i should have double checked before i sent you out that was my fault but you did good work got enough of the bliss infused samples that's what we needed i've had time to tweak the formula and now it's rock solid as soon as it finishes processing you'll have a new batch waiting i can't thank you enough for all you've done around here deputy sheriff said you were good 
But I didn't think you were this good. Beautiful day. My kiddo plays... <laughs> Keep doing whatever it is you're doing. Rook, I don't think those were rumors. A scout team just reported in a cult priestess is spotted heading your way. Can't be a coincidence. You only have a few minutes to secure that area. Move carefully in there. They probably have hostages. Can't let th just about bit the dust there. Thank you. Rook, sheriff here. I got the word you killed that priestess. Sounds like he even managed to save some of our own. You got the cougars back here nice and fired up. Hell of a job, Rook. Hell of a job. Hey, Rook, sheriff here. My intel's right, you've been freeing our people from the cult. Wish I had ten of you, this fight would already be over. We got lots more hostages out there.
case our people are torturing them.